there is an evolutionary reason behind FOMO. We fear missing out on social connections that our cave people ancestors would need in order to survive and have sex. It appears, according to research, our animal brains on a very basic level equate missing out on fun as missing out on the potential to have sex. The damn lizard brain strikes again. Of course, we're more advanced now with our internet and televisions and air conditionings, but the lizard brain never wants to miss a chance to get laid. We feel bad, awful when we miss a great party or a meetup. And y'all, we do it to ourselves, though. But if we are giving ourselves FOMO, then maybe we could try not to give ourselves FOMO? Learn to balance our lifestyle, life, and vanilla life in a way that keeps us from catching FOMO in the first place. Wild ideas incoming. To combat FOMO, I got a wild idea here. Find balance. Find the right balance between your vanilla commitments and the lifestyle. Put rules around what you will do and when. So instead of getting FOMO, you can use your rules and point to your rules for comfort. 